stopped by my local bank, um, talked to the bank girls. They were saving some star notes for me. So they got me a $100 star note here. We're going to look these up here at the end of the video. A $20 star note. Another $20 star note. Like I said, we'll look these up for rarity. Another one. Another one. Look at all these star notes. That's actually a pretty low serial number, too, it looks like. Or lower, anyway, than the star note. Star note, star note, star note. Um, that one is not a star note. So, looks like we got, let's see. So, we got $280 in star notes, $20 bills, um, and a $100 bill. So, $180 in 20s that are star notes, and a $100 star note. Then also, I picked up two um, $200 in singles, $1 bills. I'm going to hunt these for star notes, rare serial numbers, anything odd like that, errors, misprints, um, shifting of the different um, seals and things. But let me go ahead and hunt these up, and then at the end we'll look up these star notes and see how rare they are. So went through that $200 and $1 bills, didn't find any star notes, which is really unusual. I usually find one star note per $100, so typically I should have found two. Let me give you an example of some things, though, that else I'm looking for. So like this number here, 0, 6, 1, 6, 1, 2, 6, 1. Um, That's actually four digits, the 0, 6, 1, and then the 2. This 2 would have been a 1 or, gosh, 1 or 6 or a 0. I probably would have kept that because it was kind of pretty neat. Same thing with this bill here. This bill is 11444450. This would have been um, 11. I would have kept that bill just because it would have been unique. So you're looking for unique serial numbers, birth dates, um, you know, for instance, 1999, 06, 20. So it would have been June 20th of 1999. Um, some people collect their. their um, phone numbers, which I'm currently looking for my phone number um, if I ever come across it. I think that'd be really cool. So some people collect those, so local businesses do. Um, also looking to see if there's any kind of ink splotch. Um, you want to make sure this serial number matches this serial number. Some people are looking for low serial numbers, you know, all zeros and then like 450 for instance here. Um, some people collect really high numbers, so they're looking for 999, you know, and so on. Um, lots of different things to look for. Just have to Google it. Um, some things that collectible, this seal here. Sometimes this seal can be way over here and not even be touching the E. Um, that adds some value to it. Just lots of different things. But let's go ahead and look up these star notes that I did get from the bank girls. Um, first one is JE12304760, green star, it's a 2009. So I'm going to go to the website mycurrencycollection.com and I'll we'll actually go through one real quick. So I click $20 denomination, 2009, and the serial number is JE12304. Seven six zero and the star. Okay, so it's got a run size of three point two million. Pretty common, so it's not that rare. What we're looking for in that year would be in one of these here, three hundred twenty thousand run size or something in this range. This would have added a lot of value to that twenty dollar bill. Right now, it's just pretty much worth twenty dollars to be honest with you. Nothing unique with this bill, um, but let's go ahead and look up the next one. Okay, next bill is MG0344904. It's a 2013, so nothing special in that serial number except the star. So let's check it out. I've already got it punched in here for us. Uh, 3.2 million run size, so no, nothing special there. Let's look for another one. Okay, we've got MG 04818663 star to 2013. It's already got it punched up. Let's check it out. Nope, 
3.2 million run size, so that stinks. All right, well, let's check another one. Okay, the next one is MG00188916, Green Star. So let's check it out. I've already got it punched up for us. Okay, that was not bad. 640,000 run size, so it's on the uh, more rare right in the middle. So that one's actually worth holding on to. Um, might be able to get a might be able to get an extra five, ten bucks out of that bill on eBay or from a collector. So we'll go ahead and hold on to that one. Set it off to the side. And let's go ahead and get to the next one here. The next bill is a 2006 IE 00610197 Green Star. Okay, let's check it out. It's a little more rare. I've never seen a run that that strange. That's a strange run size. Um, but hey, it's a little more rare than less rare. I'm actually going to hold on to that one too. I've never seen anything just random like that. 2.432 million. It's kind of strange. But let's go ahead and check out the next bill. Okay. Next bill is a 2009 JL. 00996273 let's go ahead and check that out I've already got it punched in again 3.2 million run size so nothing spectacular let's check out another one next one's a 2009 JL01113190 so almost a trinary zeros ones and threes but then there was a nine in there so would have been really cool, but let's check it out. 3.2 million run size, so nothing spectacular. Okay, next bill I got is JL0569-6801. So let's check it out. 3.2 million run size, so all right, we'll try again. All right, we got JE1252983030. It's a 2009. It's not in too bad a shape either. 3.2 million run size. So, nothing spectacular with that one. The last bill we have is a $100 bill, so we'll check it real quick. All right, we got LF064 Two nine six nine four green star, so it's a series two thousand nine A. Let's see if it's how rare it is. Three point two million run size. All right, well, nothing, nothing spectacular. So, all right, guys, well, we went through all this. We did find two here that uh, might hold on to them. Two twenty dollar bills. Um, this stuff here will go back to the bank so I can buy some uh, a couple boxes of nickels or pennies so I can do some coin roll hunting later but uh, if you like the video please please give it a thumbs up comment in the comment section down below if you haven't subscribed already please do that um, in the description down below I have some links to just some random stuff some plastic sleeves to put this stuff in um, just miscellaneous stuff but guys got any questions let me know thanks a lot